Hey y'all. So today I'm gonna show you how I do my hair every day with the big curls. Um, I used to use a three quarter inch barrel um, when I was in high school. And just now I look back at pictures and I'm like, why did y'all let me look like that? Like I had curls like all the way to my root. I can't believe y'all let me look like that. Let me get this baby bassinet out of the way. That is not cute. I, if you can see, I already went and blow dried and straightened, I mean not straightened, with straightener, just while I was blow drying my hair. Um, it is raunchy. My ends are so bad, y'all, but I will just not admit it. I don't wanna admit it, and I don't wanna have to get them cut. So I'm gonna be using Garnier Fructis. How do you say that? Garnier, Garnier, I don't know. Fructis uh, Moroccan Sleek Oil Treatment. I've used this stuff forever. I'm telling you, after my hair is done, after I've got it curled, you'll see the difference. I put this thing on the ends. It's like a leave-in treatment. Um, I don't know, I get it from Walmart or Walgreens or CVS, whatever, it's only like $4.99. It's the best and a little goes a long way um, since it is an oil, so don't put too much on or you're gonna have some greasy roots. And this is the barrel that I've been using lately, but it's from Absolute Heat and that's all I really know about it. I, don't, I just got it from my mom. My mom had this curling iron and I stole it from her, sorry mom. But anyways, yeah, so let's get started. Um, the handle's definitely broken, <laughs> but anyways, uh, that could be a Christmas gift, y'all. It's gonna be different for y'all if you don't have like a center part like I do, because I do everything kind of big curls going away from my face, but you just wanna get, go all the way down the center and I just, get all of my hair in two pieces on the sides like this and I start at the very back of my head I'll grab a big section and I curl it away like I do all the curls away um, oh okay <laughs> I'm sorry I'm so mad at this so I start in the middle do not I always start in the middle and I curl and then I pull it through the barrel like this like barely open it up so then you have like a really loose curl like that. But oh, I really think I broke my curly eye. <laughs> Whoops. Oh well. Anyways. So if you can just see oh, this little guy. He was a little straggler from the last section. Um, I'm just going right in the middle. And I do the same thing with all the hair. That one piece of hair does not want to stay in there. Let's go ahead and do him by himself. Just pull it to the end. Like you can tell, I'm not leaving it in the barrel for a long time. Um, you definitely do not want to do that. Those horrifying hair tutorials where people are trying to show you how to do something and they get to talking, they forget about it and they pull it out and their hair comes out with it. Y'all, I would cry. I like to randomly pick up pieces and curl them to, still going away from my face. We interrupt this program to bring y'all some very important news. This donut, it's the sugar cookie donut, the new one that's seasonal right now from Dunkin' Donuts. Oh my gosh, oh my gosh. Y'all, seriously, I've been trying to diet, quote unquote, and I've already been there three times in the last two weeks to get this donut. I don't even really like donuts. Okay, that was a lie. This is amazing, that's all I'm trying to say, amazing. Get to Dunkin', get you the sugar cookie donut and your peppermint mocha hot latte. It really is a science, y'all. It's a science. Crazy. I'm gonna go ahead and do the other side and then I will show y'all how I get volume up here so don't worry we ain't gonna have these flat heads we're gonna get some volume Ooh. so let me just finish this side over here real quick anyway so i'm gonna take this now and I just run, I just did like a pea size amount. Pick up your ends and run your fingers through your hair only on your ends to get a little bit of volume. 
I, I have this round brush. I like to take it right here at the crown and just pick up this little piece and barely, you wanna put the brush in the middle, pull down. In the middle, pull down. Do not put your brush on your hair and keep it on the hair and go up and down like this. That's how you damage your hair. Just put it on the hair, pull down, pull the brush out. In the middle of the hair, pull down, pull the brush out. Now I've got it. <laughs> now it's like really teased. But anyway, so I just like to pick up random. I kind of just do a halo around the crown of my head. After you've done that up there, you want to barely run your brush across the top of it just to smooth it out. And I'm gonna pick up other random pieces of hair.